Hey, it's Mr. Petito from Wham's Tech, and today we're going to show you how to troubleshoot Google Slides. And now, every so often, Google Slides, when you go to launch it, will crash on you. Something similar to this. I'm going to go ahead and open up Google Slides, and I go to open up one of my slides here, and I'm, maybe I'm working on it a little bit, but then after a few seconds, it crashes on you, and you're back to your home screen. Okay. Um, it's something to do with our WA Secure Wi-Fi. Um, it usually resolves by itself. Usually our IT department might have to go in and adjust something on our filter to allow the, the traffic to go through. But until that happens, there's two things you can do in order to work on your Google Slide. The first thing is um, go ahead and switch your Wi-Fi over from WA Secure to Woodward Wi-Fi. Now you're not gonna get any internet traffic on Woodward Wi-Fi, which means you're not gonna be able to go out to Safari and browse around and access search and YouTube and all the other things, okay? Um, so you'll be able to just open up the, uh, the slide. So I can go to Google Slides now. I can go into my slide here and you'll see that it's not gonna crash on me, right? I can go ahead and edit any of these, okay? Um, and then when I'm done, I can switch back to WA Secure and um, continue on. Now, your other solution would be to go back to settings and stay on WA Secure like you see here. Go to Google Slides, find the presentation, hit those triple dots underneath the slide here, and then you're gonna copy the link to this presentation. Hit Home, go to Safari, and in the address bar, paste in the address to your Google Slide. As long as you're signed in with Google, you should now be able to access that slide in Safari. And because you're the creator of this slide, or at least an editor of the slide, you'll be able to edit the slide here in Safari as well. Uh, if it prompts you here at the bottom, uh, say, no, I'm not interested. That way you can stay in Safari to edit this slide. And you can see I can access any of these slides now and go in here and edit any of the text and so forth. All right, if you have any questions, feel free to email me at robert.petito at and as always, thanks for watching.